Welcome back to my channel. Where are we? Welcome to the Cayman Islands. Right. We're in paradise. We're in paradise. Why are we here? To work, apparently. We're famous. we're famous. The hotel is having a opening of their spa, and so they wanted to bring on dancers. Yes. And that's why we're here. And it's honestly more of a vacation. We got here and like immediately we're champagne. offered champagne and margaritas <laughs> and like feast your eyes. Jesus. Flew from LA to Charlotte and then Charlotte to here. It was a red eye, but honestly, with homies, a red eye is kind of still a big vibe. I hate red eyes. I hate them too, but I enjoyed them. <laughs> I enjoyed this journey. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow we have rehearsal, but today we get to just chill. Apparently, the water is hella warm. When you come, you come correct. Wi Fi trip, and you connect. Living so plain, you can complain. If you need the money, come and collect. If you need some good love and come and call it All my wrongs when you call it You are my number one subject to oh, baby What do you let me detail? All of me some independent, fine African girl You're looking fine at every time I see you, girl We've lounged, we've drank some fun drinks We've, we've been, been cruising Cruising We weren't expecting that in and out of the water. We're here at, what's it called? I want to say the White Lotus. Yeah. We're, we are White Lotus. Yeah, it's, it's, That's what it's we are White doing. Lotus yeah. vibes. But we didn't know. We didn't know what it was going to be like. No. Thankfully, we got here today. We got to lay. The clouds coming in. Yeah. <laughs> the body is uh, running around. We've risen, I'm so incredibly exhausted, but also woke up just feeling like, I can't believe we're here. I had two hours of sleep yesterday and then immediately got here and went to the beach and just spent the whole day outside. So feeling tired. What time is it? It's like 10 something. We were gonna wake up at eight, which would have been 5 a.m. our time, which is a hilarious attempt and was never gonna happen and didn't happen. So I have a feeling that most of this day is going to be very similar to yesterday, which is probably gonna pull up at the beach and swim and eat food and relax and then go to a very chill rehearsal. <laughs> this is the lifestyle for me. Like, why am I not living this all the time? I'm drinking coffee. I don't drink coffee, but I'm doing it today. I'm gonna, I think, take you on a little tour. You saw the outside. It was absolutely gorgeous. I'm in the master bedroom bathroom currently. It's cute. This is where me and Kaylee slept yesterday. This is where we were just at outside on the water. Living room, dining room, kitchen. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Do I need to click the thing? Okay. Thank you.
rehearsal, it went great. Woo! Final dress. Final great. dress. Now we have an hour and a half until showtime. I'm nervous a little bit. Once we're in the water, I'm chilling, but it's more like Back the mingling. Can we start on the same size? Yeah, we do. So do you want to just talk? Yeah, I do. Right, cool. Amazing. Dude, feel it. Feel how. <gasps> Okay, this is what we're wearing. Are we going to a dinner or is yes. it? Yes. Okay, yes. we're afterwards. going. Oh, afterwards. We're going to a dinner afterwards, but we're gonna get some food beforehand. <laughs> <laughs> last night and it went really really well we ended up getting food after that and then we went out they have a club that's called bambi that was open and we just danced our hearts away we really did we danced for a long time we are going to head to the hotel and relax before our flight the airport's like 10 minutes away and then i get home into california at 10 45 yeah it's been an incredible trip i have no complaints my heart is I think this is where we're gonna sign off. We might montage it out. Thanks for coming with me on this journey. Wish I could have shown you a little bit more of a little bit more of the performance, but also it's okay. I'm manifesting more trips like this in my future. May this be the new norm. Do you wanna see? Last day. Last day, sad face. <laughs> Last day, best day. I might need a couple days of like <laughs> Hilarious because we've been resting this whole time. No, I get it. But rest. Yeah. Like sleeping in. I'm gonna pee and then I'm gonna go home. still intact. I was supposed to get home at 10-ish last night. It is 2 p.m. I got home at 1. I'm freshly showered. God bless. We landed in Charlotte and honestly I was gonna stop the vlog leaving Cayman but I just need to tell you what happened because it kind of blew my mind. I've never had such a crazy flight experience. We got a text that our flight was gonna be delayed three hours so that was already like a Oh, that sucks, but it is what it is. When we get to Charlotte, we waited around, we got food. The second L for me personally was, there was this weird dude that kept smiling at me and like just weirding me out. I'm on the plane, I'm looking for my seat. I'm sitting next to him. It's a five and a half hour flight. I just really didn't want to deal with it. I sit down, I'm uncomfortable. I have my hoodie on, I'm literally just like in my hoodie. And so I message one of the girls, hey, can I come sit next to you? The third L was that there were mechanical issues going on. So we were still sitting around. There was like this big family that was being so loud, just instigator energy. One of the moms, one of the students, she's like, what's going on, what's going on? I feel like you guys aren't telling us something. I just want to get home, da, 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 da. And the stewardess was like, why would you say that? We just, you know, we're relaying all the information that we were given to you. There's nothing that we're hiding. It was just so weird. Evidently the flight was too heavy and the runway that was open wouldn't have been long enough for our flight to take off because of the weight so they were basically saying that some they wanted some people to get off the crazy family got off which was god bless then one of the stewardesses hopped on the intercom thing and was like the pilot's no longer here with us not sure what's going on we have no updates but at this point we apologize if you guys all want to just like get off the plane basically find another flight like let's do that everyone unboarded we were on there for like an hour and a half or something
and then they tell us that we have to wait nine hours for our next flight. I, I've never slept at the airport before. I literally slept on the ground, which was disgusting, but I was so tired and it was freezing and my body was curled up in my hoodie. Everyone was kind of miserable as fuck. They kept on switching the time of our flight. <laughs> that was chaotic. Two of the girls went to go and get coffee at Starbucks and there was a mouse running amongst the mugs. It was just a crazy, crazy experience. We finally got on our flight. It was a five and a half hour flight we finally landed and everything from there went pretty smooth got my uber home but it's funny because you know we had such an insanely amazing experience and then this happened and it was just very humbling god was saying don't let it go to your head bitch you're still a broke artist i'm finally back home it was an amazing trip with really great people <laughs> I laugh, I laugh at this last bit of the trip because I think that's only fair, you know, balance. You gotta restore the balance, can't be too happy for too long. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and that's about it. Yeah, peace. Ooh, I am black and black and black and black and black. Sorry, I'm really tan and I'm living for it. Wow, my hands look white. That's crazy. Ooh, hope it sticks. Anyways. Thank <laughs> you.